On game night, winning is everything. But life's big wins happen off the field. When you win a heart. When you win their trust. When you win their respect. First Bank's community banking is perfect for life's big wins because of what we're big on. You. Make us part of your team for life's biggest wins. his hands are joined together. Is it time to start? I think it is. Here we go. I'm interested to see how John Carrier is going to do after a couple of a couple of games out. Right. Yeah, he's, he should be fresh, but uh, he has had a little bit of an injury. It's, it's good to have him back in the squad. Yes. But I'm interested to see how his fitness will be and uh, if he can last the whole 90 minutes. Here. Okay. stuff from Memphis FC here at the very beginning. Just a little bit of possession out of the back. Mm -hmm. Now a long ball down this right hand side. Good header away there. And uh, Memphis, Memphis FC uh, mm -hmm. throwing on the right side. That was a good touch in, in space yeah. there by Kieran. He was able to get himself out of trouble and, and just turn and, and play the open man here. Again, same thing. Try and push up and keep him there. Yeah. Usually, when you get a throw in that deep, the 
teams like to push forward and, and really constrain that space. And this is exactly why you get a quick turnover and then a you know another pass across the box and. Could have, that could have been a score chance been. there. Could have been. Been. Was, on Wednesday, we, mm -hmm. we were talking about wanting the team to stay a little bit higher and find those right. opportunities to, mm -hmm. to win the ball higher up the field. It's, sure. it's good to see them doing that here early sure. in the game. And Memphis FC with another throw in after a really strong header out of the back on CFC. Bottom right hand corner of your screen. Good flip there, number 10 for Memphis, and they're able to win possession and go out the other mm -hmm. way. Number 10, Felipe Oliveira, is going to be a guy to watch throughout the rest of the game. Usually that number 10 position will play that attacking role that, that likes nice to role. get involved in, in, in and right. play those little spaces. So we'll make sure. I'm sure Coach Elliott has talked to the team about keeping a, a close eye on him. Yeah, here's John Carey. And that John's come out strong. He's, yeah. Yeah, he's able to get two defenders on him. So this is the first yeah. corner of the game, Chattanooga FC. And we've seen quite a few goals scored from this corner kick in several games this season. So let's see what we get tonight. Here we go. Oh, that was nice a great flick on. Oh, I think it's going to be another corner kick here, Simon. I think so. Yes, it is. It is. Yeah, that was good um, defending. It really was. Again, this could be something completely different. Yeah, you see... You see a CFC player in there with the goalkeeper I see him a little interfering a bit. Yeah, the uh, goalkeeper did well gets there. Gets the hand to yeah. it and it goes out again for another corner. Opportunities so, in. That's right. Here we go. Short. Corner played short here. It's short. Luis True with the ball, kicking it across. It's a great ball Flips in. It's on. Oh, Ooh, the keeper's arm. Good save. Good save by the goalkeeper. Sure, the keeper's arms, but I, I think the referee's blown his whistle for a foul. But either way, the. Uh -huh. The goalkeeper made a great save. He wouldn't have right. known that the referee blew the whistle. No, no, you never. It was a good header as well. I think I'm, wasn't quite sure of the foul, but hey, mm -hmm. either way, same same thing happened. No, no harm, no foul there. Right. And right. Uh, we're playing forward with the the long kick from Memphis FC's goal. Here we go, back one. into play, deep into Chattanooga South, but flicked away. Old in the end of that one to uh, take care of it. <laughs> it was a good cushioned mm -hmm. header there by Snoopy Davis. It really was. Yeah. He's one of those players who, who loves the ball in the air, mm -hmm. loves the ball at his chest and at his right. head, and can do a great job of controlling the he game did. that way. So. Snoopy told me his family watches uh, a lot of these games, so did Michael Brooks. So, hi to you folks who are related to Snoopy and Michael. <laughs> Thank you for listening and watching in tonight. So, this is going to be a long one. Into the box. Here we go. It's a good ball. Nice ball. Flick tight. It's open. And it's oh, in the a good early net. goal! In the back That's of the net. a great net. ball. A great way to start. John Finley. Just, just as the clock turns to six minutes, wow. John Finley with a great header off of the corner. And that's yeah. that early pressure yes, you're talking about, exactly, side. Exactly. Was that five corners in a row? Five corners in quick succession. Almost. And yeah. then here we go. And ball to the back go. post. Great finish by John Mr. Finley. John Finley's there. Yeah. It wasn't a completely strong header, but no. it went in the net. That's, that's all that matters. That's all that really matters. Oh, matters. Their goalkeeper's not happy. He's kicking the post. Yeah, yeah. really. That's really it. turned it up. And uh, Memphis haven't played a game all week. They've really had a lot of time to prepare for this. Um, but I'm not sure they're ready for that. So that was interesting to see that CFC took the early lead. Now we have game on Memphis have to start playing. Yeah. So that was great. But another great goal. That's, that's John's second goal of the season. Yeah. He's been playing really well. Absolutely. So um, of course he's enjoying that one. <laughs> It's interesting to note that, that, like you said, Simon, Memphis mm -hmm. hasn't played this week, but right. on top of that, they also have not been able to play in their home stadium. All of their games so far mm -hmm. have been on the road. Okay. The first home game was actually postponed due to rain. There was some torrential downpour, lightning, and delayed right. and delayed and delayed, mm -hmm. and eventually it was postponed. Mm -hmm. So they've been on the road for mm -hmm. a lot of their early season games, right. and that may be playing a little bit of toll on the in the eighth minute, and CFC really has been... Just dominating the game so far. Greg Absolutely. is standing on, yeah, he you know, a about, bold, yeah, about that's, 10 yards uh, outside that 18-yard box. Just hanging out. And, yeah, uh, that's okay. Yeah, that's indicative that's, of, that's of how goal, plays goalkeeper's so dream, not yeah. having to touch the ball for 45 minutes and get paid the same. It's like, yeah, yeah these days work. So, right. Yeah, that's fine. So, uh, if he comes home with a clean shirt and clean gloves, it's like, he's okay. <laughs> and especially a clean sheet. Yes. He loves those. And a clean sheet and a clean shirt. Yes, we hasn't had to get dirty at all. <laughs> so Memphis are trying to build something here. Yeah. Let's see what they got. Yeah. First sustained use. possession mm -hmm. coming into this half. Right. It was a good ball out to the left side. Just working those triangles right. we talked about the other right. night. That's what Hemming's trying to put it wide over. There he goes. Yeah, that was a good ball nice as well. Ball. Uh, the touch let him down there at the end. It yeah, makes to be a little slick on that side. Yeah. <laughs> Good job of keeping possession so there. Memphis are trying to make some space for a cross, but they're not really getting very far with it. They want to get that ball in the box, and they're really being held back it on the, uh, the far side. 
Nearly, that's a nice move. Long and Greg Hartley Just punched it away. away. Yeah. I'm not sure whether Greg knew where he was there, right. but uh, in the end, it, it was safely John's away. Finley with yeah. that nice long ball. Yeah. And here we go. Warbus is coming up. Snoopy, with Snoopy with ball, coming yeah. in. Cuts oh, right. hello. What's up? Wow. Yeah, that was at a... the top of the box. CFC's having a great opportunity Ooh, here. We're at it, so, you know, I, I don't disagree with you there, kick. Simon. Scoring on Long and deep. Oh, oh good the save keeper, by the goalkeeper. Keeper can't there. hold it. Was that deflected coming it through was. the box, Simon? The, the Memphis tried to flick it away, but I think it was a deflection. Okay. He couldn't yeah. hold it. And that made it even harder for the goalkeeper, but in the so end, he made Chattanooga it. Chattanooga coming down save. strong. There's John Finley. I think that's just got away from him, but a little bit too heavy. But yeah, that was an interesting free kick. He looks really active here down this mm -hmm. right-hand side. I think he's going to find a lot of joy tonight. I think so too. And you know, John's going to John Carrier just mm -hmm. in front of him. Uh, right. Oh, that, that was handling. Oh, yeah, yeah. That was definitely a yeah. yeah. That, was a, that was a touch of the hand. But uh, with, with, to get around him for these sure. opportunities sure. to sure. get the ball in the box and have scoring sure. opportunities, and okay. I think that's going to be a lot of fun to watch tonight, Simon. I think so too. There's no exciting moment there. Yeah, that was a good opportunity for Snoop. Mm -hmm. He couldn't quite get that left-footed volley on frame, but you see. Nice. Long kick there by the Memphis nice FC goalkeeper. Yeah. Trying to go deep in the Chattanooga's half. I have a feeling that uh, the Memphis goalkeeper, Humberto oh. Peleas, yeah. is going to be a free kick. Driven long. I think that's, that's a very, be a very long bit ball. Too far. <laughs> yeah, that may be a testament to CFC's pressure and really this early part of the game, but they're not even trying to keep the ball back right. here. Right, right. It's a great strong header. Yeah, well done by Snoopy to hold the ball every, up there with his chest. Every free kick at the yep. moment seems to be going back to CFC. They're just yep. picking up and going with it again. And Something to... Memphis. Oh, and a collision there with the came keeper. Out, punched the ball no very call, strongly. No call from referee. Uh, so. I think that was good play by the goalkeeper. Yeah. And to be fair, uh, I don't think Will Roberts really wanted anything there. Right. But uh, right. good strong play by both there. Well, the keeper has to be, you know, we said before, has to come out off the line and yep. not not hold back. Yep. And that, that's part of a good goalkeeper. Ball so floated to the back post. That's oh. a strong, again, yeah. I mean, these balls are coming in strong. Um, but yeah, El Conductor may appear. He's, he's the man of mystery. And sometimes he just pops up out of nowhere. You're like, oh, there he is. So. Sometimes he just pops up in our box. And those are the fun times. Really? He's bringing a cowbell. He's, oh, bringing, <laughs> he's bringing the train with him. He is. Well, here goes uh, Snoopy again, coming down the right-hand side. Kick the ball back in. Oh, oh cut it back cut in, out, but yeah. not, not a great pass, but the, the idea was good. So, so Memphis good. trying to get some possession here and build. Mm -hmm. Just take a little bit of that pressure out of the game. Right. And yeah. that, that's not going to do it. They're not, just losing possession a easily. Bit, they yes. could have gone and relax. Let's mm -hmm. calm this game mm -hmm. down. Instead, they just invite yeah. some more pressure. There's was a good touch there by Will Roberts. Just couldn't quite get on the end of it. Um, I see he was looking for Luis there. Mm -hmm, he was. Another long ball there by the goalkeeper for Memphis. Number 11 was able to keep possession shortly yeah, there. Yeah, they're, they're not really holding possession, are they? Yeah. And that's number 11, nice Yvonne. long ball, here we go. Oh, just bounces away. Yep. Number 11, mm -hmm. Yvonne yeah. Akimovic has done a good job several times of, of trying to hold that ball up and bring the rest of his players in, but getting players around him to support him, and they're just giving the ball away very cheaply so far, Simon. Right. Seems like it. Good job by the goalkeeper mm -hmm. to keep the ball in there, but another long ball. Well won there by John Finley. Really fighting for the ball, He's getting possession, he turns around, it's over the line, so that's, that's frustrating when you play a little close to the line. I was just thinking Danny Reynolds mm -hmm. has a lot of space on that left hand side. We right. Tried to work it out there to him, he made a good run, but didn't quite work. And this is smart, this is what Memphis isn't doing. CFC's just, mm -hmm. if the ball's not on, they're just keeping it. Oh, and as oh, I say that, of course, commentators curse. Yeah, talking about keeping us. possession and then they give a cheap one away. Tape over yeah, that sorry, one. sorry. <laughs> My bad, sorry. Really? Oh. <laughs> but Memphis bringing the ball in after that that cheap giveaway in the midfield. That, again, so there's good. number 11 yeah. in that corner holding the ball up. And, mm -hmm. you know, these opportunities for Memphis are great scoring opportunities. Mm -hmm. It's a, a good time to threaten Greg Hartley's goal. And they may not have that many opportunities. And driven yeah, short, short to the, yeah, the first post. And dwindles. Save Save chance for Memphis. Oh, nice oh. shot. 
And it comes off Greg Hardy. Again, that's that's a golden message. That's a little bit of a mistake there. Wow. Not sure what happened. It just seemed that wow. it got blasted off of Greg's chest or his arms and into the goal. You can see he's frustrated. Absolutely. You don't see him make very many mistakes, but that may have been a mistake there. But to be fair, that was blasted it really from was. about seven to eight yards away. It was, yeah, you know, that was a... first chance really for Memphis yeah. FC turns into a goal. Absolutely. And that changes the game where CFC had all this possession, all this right. momentum, and right. now here in the approaching the 18th minute, it's it's all tied up one to one. Yeah. It's about... It was a nice goal. And you can see the Memphis FC coaches up off the bench really talking to their players. Hey, mm -hmm. now we have that equalizing goal. Let's settle down. Let's play. Right. Right. And and it really does change the whole game when you get that early goal. You get the momentum and. Now, now it's all equal again, and, and we're playing for the next you know, right, 70 minutes right, or so out right. on an equal foot. Let's see what so CFC can do. Oh, a blast. Good long <laughs> shot there. Blast. A little bit ambitious. Oh, blast. We want to make sure we get it right, so we're going to mm -hmm. confirm that score for the Memphis FC goal. But we're thinking it may have been number 14. I'm thinking Santiago number 14, Moore. yeah. We yeah. will confirm that, but we're thinking it was There was a lot of people in that yeah. box, and that ball went in, but I think he's the one that got the touch and hit the shot. So. A little bit more possession here right. from Memphis, and oh, good job there. We're going to have a, intercepting yeah, I think that. we're going to have a game on, but then now it's one each, yeah. and uh, Memphis don't get a lie back. That's great. It's great for the fans, and... Uh, good little flip there by... Yeah, Lewis on the ball, going yeah. going wide to Will Roberts. A good cross in the Straight box. Straight in, and Memphis right. have to head it away for a corner. Does on the flies, and we get like a really high score as they go, you know, up, up, up. And that was a lovely header. You won't Just find me complaining away. if that's the case. Yeah, absolutely. Lots of goals, lots of excitement. Yep. That makes for a fun evening here. It does, it does. It? It's a nice header from Snoopy. Just went slightly the wrong direction. But uh, still, CFC in possession with a throw. It's a good long, long throw, there. throw from John Finley. It's up in the air. Back out to Will Roberts again from uh, Kieran Bywater. Back to Kieran. Kieran's got two on him. Nice flick back from Will Roberts. That's Lovely good. ball from Kieran deep into the box. Oh, oh a little cross. too strong. Hold on, chasing the ball too down there. Strong. Yeah. Yeah. Memphis FC trying to keep a little bit of possession here. Mm -hmm. Pretty much just threw it right back to CFC. Good header there by, uh, yep. I believe that was Carl Reynolds. Right. Yep. No, no Danny Reynolds. Was Danny on. Reynolds, yeah. So Memphis trying to come forward and make something out of this. right across the field and just a bit too strong. They have settled in here in this mm -hmm. last 10 minutes. They have, so yeah. yeah. They're, they're not giving the ball away as cheaply as they were right. in the beginning. Right. Starting to pressure in the right areas and, and defend a little bit more cohesively, mm -hmm. making CFC play long balls like this. That's but, a nice long ball. Yeah, good job though by Will Roberts to track it down. And he's fighting away for it. Yeah. yeah. Uh, that's a great Shandu header. Keeping possession, concentrating on that. And then it's sloppy there, they didn't go yep. away. Santiago Moore trying to bring it up again, but Chandler's to push it out for a throw in. by Memphis, getting the ball away from CFC, working the ball down this left-hand side. Good job keeping it in, mm -hmm. and he was able to win a throw in. Well, they are working very hard down there, putting yep. it back to Luke Parker. And he went for the Meg there, it didn't mm. quite work for him, but I think he ended up winning a throw in, yeah, he did. right off of John mm -hmm. Carrier's heels there. Right. Ooh, this oh, may be an nice opportunity steal. to break. Luis True steals the ball. He's got a couple ahead of him, no support. He's holding up the ball, waiting for someone to come with him. Yeah, I think he did a good job there. I think that was I the think right that was a smart yeah. thing, yeah. yeah. Nobody in front of him, like you said, so just yeah. to keep the ball. And that was a little bit of a rash. It was, wasn't it? That was uh, a tackle. Here comes the ball, long and deep into the box for Chattanooga. Oh, just too strong. It's just a little bit too far. Right. Right. 
I don't know. I'm not too sure. And, and maybe that's something that Coach Bill Elliott has said. Let's let's get that ball back post. Right. We've seen it several times now. Let's mm -hmm. make that goalkeeper make decisions. And, and maybe right. there's a mistake later on exactly. that they can capitalize on. Yes. But that's one of those things that we'll keep an eye on through the rest and of the game. going deep, trying to come in. But, yeah, uh, good defensive work there by Danny Reynolds. Out by Chattanooga, see through in the box. Memphis going for the long shot and doesn't really come to anything. Okay. Oh, that was a really strong header. Mm, it was. It's number 26, Jerry Jr. Wiltshire. We're seeing a lot of balls up in the air at the moment. There's uh, obviously Chattanooga feel they're strong in the air and they're playing a lot of high balls. As we mentioned earlier, Nashville FC and Knoxville are playing this evening in the other half of the Volunteer Shield. And we will keep you updated throughout our game about how that game is going. Last time we checked in, in the seventh minute, just before our game kicked off, Nashville was up one to nothing, and we, or I'm sorry, Knoxville was up one to nothing, and we'll let you know if there's any other updates here shortly. Yeah. Referee played a great strong. advantage he there after that show. That did come in strong. It took uh, number 14 out there. Good mark on the ball, and the referee's called playback because of the injured player. That will add a few moments of injury time to the end of the first half, so he may see one or two minutes played after that. Craig Hartley putting the ball back in play, a long, long kick to Snoopy, but comes on his chest and goes away to Memphis. To Jake Young, letting it go deep and running out for the foot. And John Finley giving that long throw of his. A lot of holding there with Snoopy. The referee, yeah, does call it. Yeah. That was a great deal of holding there. Starting to well, get a bit, wear on his nerves a Get a bit, bit tired of it. It's a bit yeah. frustrating when you held back and not allowed to play your natural game. So, Chano playing the ball right across the field, as they say, wide across the park in England. And uh, using the full width of the field, which is always good to do. Another nice long ball. Very good. Coming in there to Daniel Reynolds. No, to Bull Roberts. Memphis heading it away. Matt Reeves was fighting for the ball there. That was a good ball out here to the left side of the possession. An even better return ball. He tried the back heel there and then right. kind of goes over right. pretty harmlessly, but you can see what he was trying to do. And you know, I think I think Memphis is having a little bit you know, better of a time than they were in those they early, early periods of the game, but still not quite as much of a foothold as they would like to have. Right. That was a great turn by John Carey. Carrier putting it going wide there. Kieran Bywall is calling for it on the left hand side. He's uh, in more of his natural position over there up front, where he likes to play, so he's got a chance tonight to really be up there. And there he gets the ball again, goes down the, down the wing, teasing the, the defenders, goes off for a corner. Good play. Here's the ball from CFC going deep, and the keeper's ready for it this time. He's uh, expecting that deep corner, takes the quick clearance. Yeah, not quite what he wanted really there, but it still, back, went, yeah, it still went to the <laughs> Spinning to the away. Player, yeah. So Luke Palmer feeding Philippe Oliveira down here, but uh, the Chattanooga FC players are back fast. And, uh, I think he's just going to shield yeah, that one out. Yeah, that's good defensive running out, play. Running out. Greg Hardy back into play wide. Long ball. Look at that, right to Excellent his feet. To that his was feet. a great ball. Wow. And then played one touch there mm -hmm. by Mr. Will Roberts. Yes. Brilliantly as well. Nice ball. Very good. A little good. bit of a push yeah, in there. He, and the, oh, no, and right, he yeah. made a run into the middle and then was able to dart out right. there, be an option again, and right. CFC was able to right. win this, this mm -hmm. opportunity to get Ball's it in. in there. Oh, oh, and there's a collision with the goalkeeper. Well done by the goalkeeper. Okay. Yeah. Snoopy's okay. Everyone was happy there. Goalkeeper popped right up yeah, after making good. a good play. Snoopy Ooh, popped right back up. Strong jackal, but the yeah. letting play go on. Good aggressive, play the advantage strong play. With, yeah. the, with the, the arms going forward, like that means they're playing the advantage. Yeah. Well done John here. Finley steals yeah, the ball back. Oh, John, look, look at Scott Kieran. Bell also wide open over there. Bam. Oh, yes. Great goal. Yeah. That's that is a great goal there. Huge 
huge defensive error by Memphis. A huge error. We got a little bit too excited here. Will Roberts, not Kieran. Kieran's behind him. Will Roberts, Will Roberts right there. What a cracking goal. 2-1. Sorry guys, you guys were excited. <laughs> we did get excited. Lovely goal for more of 2-1. Two one. In the 32nd minute, so that's 2 on the CFC. Very exciting. Yeah, we had a, a furniture malfunction there, folks. I do apologise. We got very excited here. <laughs> Those of you watching the, uh, the webcam on the uh, commentary box will see us leaping around. You don't always see the commentators doing that, but we, uh, we're leaping around there. So Chattanooga coming forward again, looking for the goal, goal number three, if they can get it. A lot of pushing over there. Balls Ooh. comes in. Memphis up to it and pushing it away. That was a dangerous ball there. You see, he tried to get that across the top of the six-yard box. Absolutely. Well done by the Memphis FC go or, uh, defenders to get that ball out of the box. Trying to play a one-two there. It doesn't quite work out. That rolls up to it, but it goes out for a corner. That was a good side. Uh, and just see what's going on and we see a different look to the game. And, oh, another. In. Oh, well done oh, by Greg oh, Hartley oh, there. On the end yeah. of it. He was able to spread himself really, really wide. He got some help from yeah. his defender on the post there. He gave him a little bit of love. He recognizes that it. But it did, yeah, it popped into his hands there. But good save. Excellent. That could have been the goal number two with the yeah. first one. And, and, and again, that's that would have been the second corner that right. they scored off of it. And these right. set pieces are so important. We can't right. stress it enough. Yeah, you know, they like, practice these, they rehearse them, they exactly. want to, they, they know their scoring opportunities, so yep. it's uh, yeah. And just one tiny mistake can lead to a goal in those Absolutely. Well, that's why we're out with the first TFC goal against CFC by Memphis was a, a slight error for a goal. Yep. So... See John Carrier know. there a little mm -hmm. bit frustrated with himself after right. a heavy touch gets out of bounds. And I think that may just be a little bit of rust, as we said. Yeah, it could be a bit of rust. Yeah, Carrier's been carrying a little bit of an injury over the last couple games. Hasn't oh, been in the squad, That's an unfortunate clearance by Memphis. Throw. Not good. good. The ball good is ball into the box, bouncing yeah. around, but... Almost a mistake that cost Memphis. Almost, there. but it went in Memphis's favour, so that was a send possession. They're back in play on the far side. And they let it roll out. They did. Throw in on the far side. That's a great turn. See if we can attack, yeah, and going down this left hand side, mm -hmm. trying to get the ball work towards the middle. It is in the middle. Looks good. Yeah, well done. Playing here. right across John Finley. Finley. He's going to drop in the box. Ball. Who's on the end of it? Cut ball. Keeper again, man. He's Punches been so out. aggressive, but he's done really well. CFC still have possession. Oh, uh, a bit of a high ball yeah. there. Yeah. I didn't like Lewis's uh, high boot there on that one. <laughs> so far, you know, we've. We've talked about the goalkeeper being aggressive and maybe coming out mm -hmm. and, and mm -hmm. making a mistake, but he's been very strong so he far. Really has. And, uh, mm -hmm. you know, Memphis needs it. They've got well, about ten it. minutes to go yeah. to halftime here. CFC would love to get another goal, and you know oh, Memphis you know would love to equalize you or know it. at least keep it two to one. So you know the goalkeeper is going to be a big part of that. CFC coming down that left hand side, just keeping possession. Kieran Bywater just really controlling the pace of this game right and uh right. matt all right now keeping it again john carry as we talked about earlier just pinching in that little bit and allowing john finley to get around him here on this right right hand, right. Right -hand side but work it comes left again and that was wide great ball. play oh, snoopy in the head. box again Job here, keeping the ball, keeping some possession on the left-hand side, trying to threaten the CFC goal, but in the end, just give the ball up for a CFC throw in here. Had a little bit of difficulty there with, you know, the live cam that we have in this box. It's part of the fun. You guys can tune in on Facebook to Chattahooligan Live and 
really just watch us in the box like Simon said. We get a little bit animated. We, we have do. a little bit of fun. We did that and the, uh, the camera got a knock as well. Yeah, I mean, sometimes this table just can't take it. And the camera That's right. starts going around. But Memphis <laughs> is trying to bring a little bit more excitement to the game. We, we want to see them score as many goals as we can. Well, we but do. It's, it's also good to see a good match. Well, it is. You don't want to see something just dominating. It gets boring after a while. So you do want to see a team, you know, come here and, and fight for it. Exactly right. Um, but not fight too hard. Shadow <laughs> <laughs> could try and play down the middle again. Memphis are breaking it up. But, uh, their clearance goes out. Ooh, sloppy. Aldred again being strong on that midfield and playing it wide. Yeah, a bit too strong, but uh, he's done a really good job right. so far. That right. the ball's always moving. Mm -hmm. That's uh, that's one of the biggest jobs for that defensive center midfielder. Right. Oh, and just doing the same thing, yeah, hitting it strong. Everyone is hitting it strong tonight. The pace of the game slowed down a little bit. Simon. It has, which you aren't expecting towards yeah, the end of the yeah. first half. That does make That's sense. A good lovely move ball there. Through Lewis. What's Lewis going to do? He's going to be one of the tricks. The last foot play. It. Love it. John Carrier. Mr. Finley has it. He's going to play that long yeah, ball. It's he a good plays. diagonal ball to deep. Snoopy. Snoopy, a little bit too deep. A little oh. bit too far. But and Snoopy's aerial presence is, is really causing a problem for me. It is. It's uh, making them look out of their shoulder, which is, is, makes the defenders look. Oh, oh there's a push. That's oh, easy. hello. Referee's standing right there. And Memphis players questioning, but I mean. Jake Young taking the kick. He's playing it long and deep towards Kieran Bywater, who's almost on it. So, uh, the throw at CSV taken quickly. That's a good touch. Oh, that's a good shot. A little bit too. Maybe a little bit of time added on for injuries and stoppages. And the head tennis going on. A little bit low yeah, head tennis there. there. That's a yeah. nice one, though. Johnson oh, is looking at better ball. Lovely finding Kieran yeah. by water. See Very nice. Kieran's one gonna one bring it in. Kieran's gonna go for the shot. That's a good save. And a good save by the goalkeeper. Oh, up now. Mm -hmm. Ball's coming in. It's that same long deep ball. Flicked away and goes out for a goal kick to Memphis. Long goal kick. There by the Memphis FC mm -hmm. goalkeeper. Deep in. Good header there by mm -hmm. Matt Alder. CFC trying to get that long ball, making the Memphis defenders commit to it. Comes back to John Carrier. Oh, and he gets a push over, but the referee says nothing, and the play goes on. Jake Young playing it a bicycle kick over the back of his head, and Matt Aldridge flicking it away. Jake Young again. Here comes the head tennis. Volley. Volley. I would like to Volley. see the ball on the ground. <laughs> and there it is, Luis. You can always count on Luis to get that ball on the ground. Right, he's playing Kieran White down that left wing again. Yeah. He's got Kieran's some help. Got, he's got support. Oop. Didn't come uh, to Memphis anything. Memphis has an opportunity nice to transition tackle. here. They're going for the long ball, and that's offside. Oh, and Greg Hartley oh, went off his line. He wanted to play head tennis. Yeah, play yeah that, that his... header was about oh, yeah. 40, 50 yards. Absolutely. So off his, off his head like a yeah. bullet. Yeah. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> he just wants to get involved. He does. I think he does. I would too. I wouldn't right. sit there getting bored at the back, right, of the, yeah. back of the game. I want to yeah. play. So Memphis are trying to cut their three on four, trying to find a little gap here, but uh -oh. broken down. Yeah, Ooh, good clearance. That away. was needed. It was. See the Memphis player mm -hmm. bearing in there. Memphis trying again. Go down the left wing. Barrett Mills with the good cross. And in. straight in the Gregor Hartley's waiting hands. He As they say, troubled with that one. none shall pass. None shall pass. <laughs> And I like that he's keeping possession, not just knocking the ball straight up right. the field. About a minute left in mm -hmm. the Deep first ball. half. Sleepy Davidson, Sleepy gets the bounce. Can he? And he's being pulled. A lot of pulling, but Sleepy giving his good. Yeah, that's a good deep free kick. CFC winning possession from that almost straight away. Using the space very well. 
Well, he's trued over here on the left wing instead of being on the far side. He's really all over the field. He's just floating around he's wherever everywhere. the ball is. He's everywhere. Yeah. Now, Aldridge putting it long and deep. Yeah, Will's going to chase it down there and make it difficult for him. Memphis yeah. go back into the moment. Ooh, it was a mistake there, but Memphis did a good job of keeping that. Yeah, there you go. Yeah, long ball. A little better. Yeah, one Chase minute of stoppage time has been One announced. minute, okay. Yeah, so I'm not. surprised by that, honestly. Like I, I said, we've had a, a couple. Of, there's yeah, an offside call there. We had a couple of goals, the, the two right. injuries from right. the start, but hey. Here he goes. And it falls to Chanuva again, and they're able to clear it back into Memphis' half. And that really seems to be the difference in this first it, half, Simon, is... Chattanooga is not only winning the first ball out of the air or you right. know, off of clearance, you know, what we would call a 50-50 ball. Mm -hmm. Chattanooga is winning the majority first, of the chances, right. but they're right. also winning what we would call the second ball. Okay. So whatever happens after that, whether it's mm -hmm. a flick off the head or you know you a clearance, Chattanooga is winning that second ball. And you know, they're just that little bit quicker, and we think that's the difference here. I in think the, that is. Beginning of the first I think half. that's really On game night, winning is everything. But life's big wins happen off the field. When you win a heart. When you win their trust. When you win their respect. First Bank's community banking is perfect for life's big wins because of what we're big on. You. Make us part of your team for life's biggest wins. Hey, this is Cam. This is Brian Beamett. This is Caleb from Chattanooga Football Club. Reminding you to get your flex tickets. Get your flex tickets. Come get your flex tickets from cfctix.com. Do you want to take it for a spin? Really? Hold on. Restaurant gift cards, art, hotel stays in your favorite Chattanooga attractions and more. Bid or buy at the We Love Chattanooga auction. It's a great way to support your favorite hometown business. And 100% of the proceeds go back to them. Visit Chattanooga.com slash auction. Yes, we can. They're about to go. Here we go. Second half underway. It seems like Memphis City FC has... We made a couple substitutions here coming into the second half. Mm -hmm. Number four has come into the game, and also number 23 has come into the game. We'll let you know what positions they're taking up and who they have taken off as soon as we can get those details correctly for you. And they're just trying to keep possession here, trying to build and oops, see number four, who did just come onto the field, go down there in the middle of the, the middle of the field. Right. It seems like he's taken up maybe in a attacking midfield position or maybe a free roll but again right. we'll we'll get to those details as they come in not seeing any changes for chattanooga they're starting yep. with the same 11 that stuck finished the first half Something going here. That's 
Chatterton who played the, the deep ball. Well, that's yeah, deep again. It goes out for a goal. Chatterton in favour. Not that we're biased, but uh, we are looking for you know goals. Is why we watch the game. Why you watch it at home? Simon, anything that you noticed in the first half that maybe needs a little bit of changing from either squad in the second half, or what? What is Memphis going to do to try to get back into this game? What do you think? I'm, I'm thinking they're going to start using the ball more and Costa on accurate passing. They, they've made some good moves and they have all broken down. That's the one they're breaking down. They've got to concentrate on possession. That seems to be what's letting them um, struggle today is their possession is just not as good as it should be. Uh, they're, a, they're a capable team and there's some uh, some good players in their squad, but their uh, it's possession is what they've got to work on. It's, it's the fundamental to stuff that... I, I coach kids to do soccer and I say, I know it's boring, you've got to get the passes right. CFC wins a throw in here on this left side. It's true again, trying to get around two players and getting in trouble there, but he's, uh, he's up Ooh, again. That was a nice, nice little flick. Was that a nice little flick? Classy. Uh, that's a good recovery there. Yeah, see, Matt Aldred making the recovery. Referee ways play on, no foul. Memphis trying to break. And uh, wasn't a terrifically good shot from Luke Parker there. But Greg did a good job to come get that one. He though, did because it was deflected. Yeah, a bit. it was it deflected. Was, that would have gone It wasn't going corner. straight. Yep. There's a nice long ball. Look at that. Almost to the Memphis box. Well done by Will Roberts. Will Roberts here to battle. fighting Ooh. for it. Couldn't Just quite bring it under One his defender control. too many. But uh, Memphis putting it out for a throw. That's what I mean, is that the attention and detail on the passes, <coughs> that's what's letting them down. If they can get those passes straight and not let them go out for throws, that will help them for sure. It's a nice move by the referee mm -hmm. here, Simon. Did you see that little I play? did. <laughs> yeah, that was good. <laughs> It's always fun to see mm -hmm. them play with the ball, see if it they is. have any skill or if they're just you know, oh, out there. There's they have, a push. Sometimes the referees have a really, really good knowledge of the game, but maybe they always. haven't been players. And so it's, it's always interesting to see you well, know, those right. referees who have a good touch you can and, always and like to like impress nice the players a little bit. That was a good day. That was a little bit too far, but yeah. you can see what they're trying to do. It's consistent with that first half, these long diagonal balls, Josh. these balls to the back post. Mm -hmm. Try and make the Memphis City FC goalkeeper come to try and claim them right. and uh, put him in dangerous situations. Mm -hmm. And Snoopy's aerial presence up there has, has caused a problem throughout the first right. half, so I'm sure it's we're going to see a throw. Yeah. Another ball right away, in the box. Chattanooga keep possession. Oh, look at oh, that. It's a good strike. Oh, over the far left-hand side of the goal. Goalkeeper wasn't moving on that he one. He didn't see that uh, one, yeah, did he? Yeah, <laughs> Definitely grown in number a little bit as mm -hmm. they usually do. Right. I think as people get involved in the game, they're not quite exactly oh, sure. Oh, here's an opportunity. For a maybe. To flick the ball yeah. in, but yeah. another goes. corner kick for CFC. Yeah. Forcing defenders to make a make an error. Like you're I right. was saying, yeah, a lot of people kind of come to the games. They and they're, do. They're not quite sure what to do with these hooligans dancing and singing right. and throwing scarves and you know <laughs> just gesturing the entire game. But right. you know right. maybe 30 minutes in, they're like, okay, that looks like I fun. Could do this. They, I they could inch do this. towards. Yeah. Section right. 109. And they start. And uh, hey, it's a lot of fun down there. We've spent a couple couple games down uh -huh. in, that, in that mess, and uh, I know you have too, Simon. Oh, lots, it's, lots of many it's, years. It's a fun game. It's a fun part CFC of the game. Playing oh. another shot similar yeah. to John Carrier's. It was a good short end. corner there. It really was. Well. Again, this is kind of like the first half where they were keeping it in the half, Memphis's half and not letting them really get in the Chattanooga's half too much. It's it's a good that, turn there. It was a nice. Oh, ah, Memphis defender getting in the way there. It was an important the captain. Captain's sorry, Josh. Well, Josh Fine, sorry. Not, sorry. And playing that short corner again, CFC. It's Almost to repeat, but this time it's not being driven, it's in, flicked in. Chattanooga keeping possession. Looking to put the ball back in the box again. Yeah, CFC won another mm. throw in. Danny Reynolds taking the throw. Sniffing with the ball. Luis going right across the other side of the field, doing a give That's and go, but Memphis read it. 
and he goes out for a goal kick. Yeah. We have several several mm -hmm. other games going on. Uh, we have Birmingham playing the New Orleans Gestures, and last we checked, Birmingham was winning that game one to nothing. Mm -hmm. We also have an updated score from the Volunteer Shield, the other game in in you know what we would call the you know the friendly Tennessee competition. Uh -huh. The Volunteer will be Shield. here on Tuesday evening at seven thirty, folks. If you're watching the web stream and can't get down, and maybe you can make it Tuesday evening, we'd like you to come down and see a game for yourself. And we'll be entertaining Knoxville, which is always an interesting game. There's a certain amount of uh, friction between the two sides in that one, so <laughs> always a game worth coming to see. Yeah, the force are a good sign. They are. Uh, I'm interested mm -hmm. to see what, what they bring to Chattanooga this year as we see the Memphis City Memphis FC. Memphis first 10 minutes of the uh, second half. Still 2-1 to Chattanooga. And again, they're trying to come forward. That is well broken up by Memphis. Give away the throw-in, but you'd rather that than a, than a ball oh, that yeah. makes your defenders turn and chase. Mm -hmm. See the Memphis City mm -hmm. FC coaches telling their players to get forward mm -hmm. and get more options higher up the mm -hmm. field, and that's one of the things that's been a, a problem. Is you know they're, they're trying this possession that you're talking mm -hmm. about, Simon. But they're right. not doing very well because there isn't runners, there isn't movement and options in There's, front of the yeah. person. There's no one to pass so, it to. You know sometimes they force it into and areas again, that maybe they don't need well, to. Just, but uh, that's what we've seen through a lot of the game. It really hasn't worked for them. Although they're making the right ideas, it's not not come together yet. And it's important to note that it's still very, very early mm -hmm. in the NPSL season. You know, a right. lot of these players are just coming together. They're just starting to meet each other. So in the same way that the CFC team is, you know, trying to gel and, you know, get their feet underneath, they've played all of their games so far on the road because their, their one home game that was scheduled got postponed. So and all that stuff causes some problems. And you see just a cheap foul there mm -hmm. by Snoopy Davidson. Right. We'll see Memphis City, you know, get some players forward and, and try and drive the ball in the box. But, uh... Yeah, I don't know. The, the game is kind of kind of going flat a little bit here. A little here, bit Simon. flat. Yeah, I have to see. I'd like to see a little bit more excitement as we approach yeah, the uh, too, too many, minute. Too many here. really good shots on goal. Some some over the bar. But nothing uh, make the keepers work too hard. It was bobbling around in the Chattanooga box, but they're clearing it very well. Back in the Memphis half, they're breaking that run out for a no, run out for a throw. They're going to play it back to the keeper. He's just going to go along with it again. And right. Trying to probe into the chat of the ball, yeah. but yeah, not Knocked a problem. Down. And we, we mentioned it at mm -hmm. you know at the break there, right at right as halftime. Came. Right. And, nice uh, steal. And CFC is not only Hold winning the back, first though. balls, he, they're yeah. also winning the second ball, and, and that's really kind of been the difference in the game. The referee you calls know? that back for a handball, and there's a, a word with Kieran Bywater about it. And he hasn't finished talking to him yet. <laughs> Kieran's gone off. Deep into the Chattanooga box, they're up to it and it's away. Memphis trying to put it away again. The defenders are getting rid of it, but it comes out to Luke Parker. Ooh, it was a good little ball. He's going to shoot and then is away with it. And yeah, business as usual. Right. They're going to go back to pushing in the box for this oh, yeah. kick. And the ball's in, pushed away. Lovely header. <coughs> Jake Young there, it's first to the ball, it's first pushed the ball, it's pushed away. So, no problems there. Memphis trying to come down that left side again. The ball is still loose in the box, but Chattanooga will get it away. Good control on the chest there. Yeah, Memphis are trying to push for a gap to get a shot in, but they're being denied each time. I'm going to play it right back to their halfway line to, to regroup a little bit. And this is about the time in the games where we start to see substitutions get up and right. moving, but I don't see anybody moving on Nobody either at all. Side. Nobody's off the bench. Yep. It's um, the coaches for Memphis are off the bench, but uh, nobody else yeah, is at the moment. It. 
Uh, well, keep in mind, it. they have made those two substitutions, so right. they That's may a nice be a little bit out. fresher than CFC. Well done by Snoopy, Snoopy there. Front. And a good ball to Will Roberts. Will Roberts three. Will has got two on him, but he's got Snoopy in support. He's holding the ball up for uh, Luis Trues. Uh, no, not no, Luis. That was Kieran, I That's think. Kieran. <laughs> oh, they changed switch. places on yeah. me. So. Oh, bit of a push there, yeah. The referee saw yeah. that one. Yeah. Simon, I think I think the referee has that oh, card out. There's that. Uh, hey, uh, there he didn't even have to do it that time. He got there it out nice and quick. And, and you can see that Matt Alred, Alred right. Reed had had. He did. You know, he but took some exception to that. Number 23 yeah. been pushing around yep, yep. in the box, and he says, "Yeah, this is persistent fouling." Yep. It's a yellow card. Yes. Yeah. You've seen you've seen retaliation. Oh where, gosh, yeah. You know, somebody ends up with a red off. card. Yeah, yeah. and that's. That's not something that I've we seen want. The, the pros do that, and it's, yep. it's embarrassing. Man, yeah, but it does happen. A really good ball into the box yeah, there. So have a, a long kick in from Chattanooga. Looks like it's floating it in. Swinger. Here it comes. Oh, it's a great driven Lovely. ball. No. Ooh, well done by the defender Memphis there. up to the job yep. and goes out for a throw on the far side. Not University and their Chattanooga campus. They offer both on-campus classes or online cat classes if you have a busy lifestyle. You can find them at chattanooga.bellhaven.edu to learn more. Uh, I think the referee called handling there. I think he did. A little dangerous. Ooh, yeah. <laughs> you see Snoopy's eyes light up from here. He yeah, wanted that he was one. like, ooh, to steal that and Couldn't a shot an open goal. It, That's uh, not something the goalkeeping coaches recommend you do. <laughs> <laughs> so, there you go so far. No, he's played well in all his games so far. So. Another long ball by Gregor Hartley. Memphis won the second ball there. Able to bring it under control. It's a good play here by Memphis. And the ball just overruns. John Finley breaks it up. Yeah. Oh, great touch. Lovely. Lovely from Luis. Was looking up. Sensible just stuff face. here from CFC. Just, just trying to keep the ball a little bit. Take the air out of get the game. A, get it in an optimum position. Yeah. The longer CFC has this lead, the more they're mm -hmm. going to make Memphis City just chase the ball, well, make their, their legs get tired, make sure that's that they're right. expelling a lot of energy to mm -hmm. try and get the ball so that when they get it, they can't break quickly or be right. as dynamic as maybe they would have been. They're trying to get yeah, the break trying going. Trying to be some, yeah, that, again, some dynamic that passing. play not, here. Not as yeah, great yeah, as it could have been. It's just not mm. quite as sharp as we right. want it to be. Right. Either, Simon. They're trying this to get the right give and go going here. through. Yeah. A nice attempt at a give and go, and it just breaks down. Again, yeah, passing the there. Ball. Passing was behind the attacker, and he was nowhere near it. So... Well, Snoopy's going to chase that one down, Snoopy's I think. Yeah, well done. Yeah, excellent win. That's good work. And that won't show up in the stat line, but no, getting but CFC kind of possession like that, that's yeah. that's a that's lot of unnoticed work, mm -hmm. but you know, we can see it from up here. I know you guys can see it from home. Right. That's the Chad Hooligans definitely see, oh, it. They see it. Definitely <laughs> appreciate it. So you know that's the that's the kind of work that you like to see your forwards putting in and really helping the team. Yep, definitely. Quick break here. Luis is driving the there. He really is driving. Oh, nice. that's a good oh, ball. Oh, well broken down by the Memphis defense. I would have loved to see Will take that, oh, that touch with his left foot forward mm. instead of back across that defender. Right. Once you do that, you give him the opportunity to get a leg in. Mm -hmm. you know, it looks really nice if you beat him, but uh, take one touch and smack that thing. Mm, absolutely. That's how you get goals. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Taking chances. And... You never know what's going to happen off a deflection or something like Correct. that. Correct. So, Correct. Yeah, you, know, you can see what he was trying to do, but sometimes the the direct route is the best way. Memphis having to play it back to the keeper again. And we have an 82nd minute update mm -hmm. from that game in Knoxville. An unbelievable goal, apparently. We've seen a bicycle kick find the back of the net off of a corner kick. Knoxville's leading that game now 3-2. Yeah, wow. And what seemed to be a, a really, really good goal by Fisher. Sounds like a great game. From Knoxville, yeah. 
It's I exciting play, stuff going on. I hope they play as well and they come down here, but not enough to score too many goals. Not that well. Not but that uh, well, as in entertaining. Yes, when exactly. they come here on Tuesday match, night. But, you know, we, so, we don't want them playing their best game right, of the year. Right, but uh, they'll be here Tuesday night at 7.30. Yeah, it's going to so be a good we, one. We hope you can join us for that game live, either on the stream or here at the stadium with us, we hope. There's, there's a lot there. more, lot more soccer to come in this Chattanooga yeah. FC season. And there's still a lot of, lot of time left in this. Still game. trying Memphis to. Memphis is trying to yeah, come forward. See that's Luke Parker again. Him, him in particular, he's gesturing to people, right. pointing where right. you know, he wanted them to go. Well, right. Yeah, you know, they right. weren't there, so you know the ball just went out of bounds, and Gregor with the long clearance. And John Carey yeah, has the opportunity now. Does John Carey get yeah. do some magic? Okay. There he goes. Okay. Yeah. Oh, he's going to try oh. it. But Luis picks up the loose ball. Luis is going to come through. Goes yeah, wide. Let's see if we can get it in there. With Kieran Bywell. Oh, that's a great ball. Oh, oh, just too long. Nice throw with that. The CFC players seem to be picking up that warm up just a mm -hmm. little bit, Simon. They I think are. we may see somebody here I in the next I think they will give somebody else some playing time. Yep. Um, but uh, yeah, Coach Wilson, he was happy with this squad. And so. Um, it's proved right. It's, it's, you know, played well. They've, they've played well, and they're, they're working well together. So they're... And it's a testament to the depth of the squad. Right. And we talked about that before the match. You know, Coach Bill Elliott's very, very confident. Mm -hmm. No matter who's on the field, that we're going to execute the game plan. We're going to do what we need to do to win. Right. And, and the players are proving it here on the field. Players who have been injured, mm -hmm. players who haven't even played yet this year. This right. is their first right. time. And, and here they are executing. You know, playing very well against the Memphis City team. That's and there's a that great really oh, is a, a, coming a down strong the team, side. as you can see there. They're right. They're into every challenge. They're playing really, really hard. Mm -hmm. we'll, um, is that the that's coming down the fast? I think it was one of those yellow boots. Stay down there. Yes, there he goes again. He's uh, working hard. Ooh, that was a good interception. Necessary interception. Ooh, that would have gone right to Luis, I think. Gonna add, oh, here we go. Ooh, one more. Oh, Memphis breaking ball. it up nicely. And there's a handball. Yep, yeah, yep. that bat stop in the scroll there. Yeah, and here's a good hand opportunity ball. for uh well, Chattanooga to ball. put them in here on Tuesday. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You know, mm -hmm. Try and keep them out of the net. Here we go, a nice little kick. shot. Ooh, that's oh, a keeper. A little bit of a mistake there by oh, wow. the goalkeeper. Not sure where. We're going to see yeah. them near side here. Yeah. Uh, in the 70th minute, they're going to float it in. Good Who's ball there? Driven in. Who's there? Ball oh, loose in the ball box. Ball bouncing in the box. Yeah, it comes out. It's out to Luis. He's going to bring it back in. This play is not over. Here on Bywater, oh, pushed over in the yeah. corner. Like the push. Well, it was definitely a push over. A strange decision, but on we go. <laughs> yeah, not sure what happened there. It seemed like there was a push, but yeah, the off. referee hasn't called it. it it's deep in that corner, hidden. so I don't, I don't yeah, know what exactly. It's hidden behind the yeah. wall, so we'll yeah, check maybe. on that later on, see if somebody close to the action give us a, a story on that. But it didn't look. What, what we expected at all, and there's that. See, there's that yep. uncertain passing. Yep. That's a good Memphis, little flick. And they were getting a the shot in, but from, that from there very that often against arguably one of the best goalkeepers well, in the NPSL. And one of the, you know, he he really has multiple you know, golden glove yeah, winner. He's gotten that award. <laughs> I'm not just saying that. Other people think he's pretty good too. Multiple but, golden yeah. glove winner and MVP yeah, winner exactly. over the years. So, so, you know, I, I don't think thirty yards. I'm sure Greg has broken a sweat too much tonight. Yep. Memphis trying to get some possession. Just they're not able to eventually settle into the game and and start with the rhythm uh -huh. and start mm -hmm. some passing. Mm -hmm. It just hasn't happened. And mm -hmm. you know maybe that's just because the Chattahooligans are, are riling them up and getting them well, a little yeah. bit off their game. Yeah, that sand carries all over the the, uh, the field. Uh, although it sounds like it's in one corner. I've seen video shot on the far side of the field by Madonna Kemp, and you can hear the hooligans loud and clear. So the goalkeeper for Memphis can hear them for sure. If they're taunting him and calling him traffic cone or something, then he hears it. <laughs> <laughs> like a review video every game of right. highlights. Right. And if you haven't checked those out, make sure you do that. Yep. She yep. does a really, really good job. Usually gets a player interview or two in there. So make sure you check out her videos. Absolutely. Uh, thank you to Madonna for that, that yeah. great work that she does. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's a great touch. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and I think... And trying to tack down that right hand side, a lot of space in front. Right, Chattanooga coming away. That's a nice ball into the ball. box here towards Snoopy. Snoopy Ooh. comes his way, but oh. the keeper comes out. You can see he didn't quite expect yeah. it to bounce towards the goalkeeper, right. and just didn't. 
didn't react in time to get there, but... It's all right. Yeah. He's still keeping the keeper yeah, keeping busy. keeping pressure on the he's, goal. He's certainly working the hardest yep. of the two keepers That's tonight, true. Carlos. Oh, yeah, absolutely. <laughs> yeah, a little bit of a suspect clearance there. Nice steal. Yeah, that was a good Look touch. At that. Steals he's had a couple just magnificent it. touches. He's playing very well today. Very well today, Luis. Is. Oh, that's a good driven ball. Oh, oh well excellent. done at the front post. Gonna try again. A good slide. Ooh. Ball Did he keep it out. in? No, no. Keep it in. Didn't quite keep it in. CFC throw. CFC throw. Yeah. Quick throw Get to Jeremiah. We're gonna flick it on. Who's there? And just oh, another man. corner kick. See people I mean, pushing and shoving, and mm -hmm. really fighting in there. We got to get some quality in the box. Is the ball and there's a little deep, bit long again? Yeah, it's, it's long. just too far. It's long. What is these long balls? Yeah, yeah at least they're not... coming. He's had a good game, but yes. they want some fresh legs. Yep. So uh, Memphis making another substitution. Chattanooga can't make any yet at all. Yeah. Working oh, those little shots. triangles though. Area yeah, a little bit more. I think so. He's been playing off the left side of this midfield in, right. in the past couple games, but mm -hmm. he's given the opportunity mm -hmm. today to, to play in that more attacking mm -hmm. midfield role um, just below the strikers, and I think he's really, really mm -hmm. found the game and really been able to affect right. it. And if he could get that goal or that assist that you're mm -hmm. talking about, Simon, he's going right. to be all the more happier and, and really just stamp his, his impact on yes. this game against Memphis. There he is with a great ball with the left yep, foot out here. Yeah, the play out from yep. the near side. Making a good run into the box. Oh, See if we can get it into him. a little miscommunication oh, there. Just off the <laughs> Looking at the weather radar here, we look like the skies are dark and not just with... Uh, bump, bump, bump. Yes. Could be a problem. And, uh, <laughs> with the... Um, Ooh, a little run here. Nice little run That's there. nice. Oh, that we was a great a... touch by Will Roberts. Chattanooga yeah, ducking and diving, the trying to turn the in. Of the box. Now just back into a little bit of possession again, right. working it out here to this left-hand side. Oh, that's a that's great a ball. long, deep ball with the keeps on the end of it. Very good. That had a really good shape. Absolutely. I was saying that uh, for that blue action not game, the skies are dark and not just in the nighttime sky. There's some storm, more storms on the way, so we may see some rain and some more of those heavy thunderstorms that sunk the Channel Hooligans earlier this afternoon. So uh, stand by. That may uh, make a difference to the game if somebody gets super wet. <laughs> yep, yep. And, uh, CFC is readying their first substitution. I believe that's our friend uh, Zeka down there about Zeka. to come on in. Oh, we Those like Zeka. Those lovely orange boots add we a little bit of like flair to the game. Let's see who's coming off. Mr. Cowrie is coming yep. off. I think that'll be a like for like switch. Pretty much. Zeka's just going to go around to that right hand side. A couple of uh, and, uh, swift strikers. Yeah. And uh, Zek has very fresh legs and is a very, very good striker, so it will be a big roar. Zek, ah, oh. there goes the crowd. Yeah, <laughs> oh, we love that. He's very popular. The yeah, they, they love him here, and it's, it's all about that personality. He has right. that flair and mm -hmm. just that little bit of excitement. You see right. him in there getting, getting into right. a challenge right away. Memphis trying to find space for a shot. That's good defending. Broken down Step again. Right so, Jake Young has just had a strong night in the room. Really has. Yes, he's had a, he's had a great season. Oh, that's so a great ball. What a great ball. 1v1 here. Let's see Kira if he can take him on. Yep. Can he shoot? Is the ball going away? Oh, that's well oh, done by the goalkeeper. Good, save, good save by the keeper under pressure. I just thought that was the third away. one. Time. I thought that was the third goal. Yep. But the keeper was strong and punched it away. But he had to be. He had no choice but to make a save there. That, yeah, was, that think, would have been the back of the net. Yeah, I think wow. Will's first touch was a little further mm -hmm. away from him than he wanted it to be. Right. You saw he was stretching for that he ball. Was. And, and I think in the end, he didn't great quite play. have as much control but a great play. on that yeah. shadow as he wanted yeah. to. But yeah, that was, mm. that was a great through ball. And then a great ball out here uh, by Snoopy in. Just couldn't quite get the finish on it. Memphis working down that left-hand side now. Trying to find a ball into the box, and here it comes. Here it comes. It's long, uh, well and it's Gregor. to Gregor. Yeah, experience here. He could play the ball quickly, mm -hmm. but he knows we're, we're in the 80th minute. Right. CFC's up two to one. Tied yeah, just relax. Give him a chance. Let the game, let the game breathe a well, little bit. Good. Experience. So, yeah. Good long ball up. Let yeah. let your team get forward. Yeah, we have ten, ten minutes CFC to play. Trying to win this ball here. Yeah, and there we go. Ten minutes to play, and I'm not seeing a lot of injury. A stoppage time. This one, maybe no. one minute, Carlos. I think so, the, the first half was more start and stop than the right. second Will half. Reynolds that was in, a great crossing ball. the ball across. He's trying to recover it again, and he does. Will's been everywhere tonight. He's, he, he's, he's, he's running his socks off. He's everywhere. Kieran Bywater. Oh, that's a good strike. 
close his foot on that. We got one. another substitution here yeah, we do. for CFC. Mm -hmm. We'll see who's coming off. But uh, I believe that's our friend Sammy Goni. Sammy Goni, another sp oh, Spanish player. Yeah. And I think he's giving Will a break. Yeah. And we just mentioned that Will has run he has and run, run and strong. run. He oh, deserves oh, yeah. this 10 minute break and, and the applause break. that he's getting. He has big breaks. He had a great goal, great work effort Sammy's throughout the game. And, uh, it's good to see got him that, get a, that second, a good that number two goal, yes. Yeah. So, and we know Sammy's hungry for more goals. Oh yeah. So Memphis is trying to get something going. It's ducking and diving blocks that block. by the CFC defence, and uh, unable to control it, it goes. And uh, we'll see if the substitution can can bring a little bit more of right. attacking punch. Well, Usually that's, that's right. what happens in these situations. Yep. You take off a midfielder, mm -hmm. maybe throw on a striker. Oh, that Memphis was a nice little space, nice little turn, trying to come through the, the CFC defence. Yeah, CFC defender just held his ground there. Foul, but yeah, he, he, referee's CFC not seeing it. Didn't even move. No, not at all. I think the Memphis player just kind of reined into him or jumped he into did. him. He did. Trying to get the ball back in the box here and deflects the CFC's Ooh. flavor. Sammy Gone has got the ball pushed over in the yep. back. Yep. Memphis got a free kick. We've got everybody up in a very Six. small, compact area. Trying to play it in the box. Looking deep, flicked on. Oh, oh great boy. hands by Gregor. Gregor Hartley right there. Yeah, that came off of a CFC player into a very, very dangerous it area, did. Simon. It did. But safe hands by Gregor. Gregor was and, right and there. experience. He's just yep. holding up the game. That's what it is. Relaxing. He's not going to be threatened by situations no. like these. Well done to Greg. Kept Flip his focus goes, on that ball. And he yeah. goes all the way through to the... Uh, that was close. To, uh, Alberto Perez again back in the goal in uh, Memphis. He's trying to drive that ball up, trying to drive his attack on. But, uh, Chattanooga breaking it up again. They're still looking to come forward to that third goal. Oh, there's Zeka. Well done. Beautiful ball. Yeah. Turn it oh, on didn't style. quite connect. Just let Snoopy away, but. Uh, Trying to come wide. Chad Nuga bringing on another player. Number two. Carl Reynolds will be coming on in the uh, mid and defense. No, he's taking off Luis. Luis is coming off. So they're going to play Carl slightly up tonight for the last uh, five to seven minutes of the game. Luis has blown himself racket. He's played so well. Very popular, big applause for Luis Cruz. Oh, yeah. What a great, great game he's had. Yeah. And Carl's just going to come into that midfield mm -hmm. and chase and play really, right. really good defense. Little make sure that the team is really, really compact mm -hmm. and, mm -hmm. and, right. and not making mistakes. Right. right. Like we talked about, we got six minutes left in regulation mm -hmm. time and then maybe some added right. time from the referee, but it right. won't be much. Maybe six or seven uh, more minutes left. And, yeah. and he's come I on the field to much. just run and, and chase and, and make mm -hmm. sure that. You know, Memphis doesn't nice get any flick. opportunities. That was nice. Didn't come to anything, though. CFC read it and breaks it down again. Um, yeah, I was going to say, they've um, played, you know, a really good game, but not able to just connect those last couple yep. of passes. Yep. So that, that seems to be the difference in the two teams. We'll say this, that there's mm -hmm. there's lots of action and lots of goals going on in the southeast of the NPSL today. Mm -hmm. You know, as we mentioned earlier, the Birmingham Hammers were up one to nothing against the New Orleans Chattanooga Chesters, again. but at halftime, that score is two to one. The Norland Chattanooga Jester. trying to break through. Oh. Ball was almost able anything. to get through there. Really? Zeka with those orange boots yeah, trying to slide it through. Just didn't quite work out for him in the end. Too many feet in the way, that one. Yep. But uh, yeah, like I was mentioning, the New Orleans Jesters are up two to one at halftime in that game, mm -hmm. and that's quite a turnaround since, oh, nice time. since that. Yes. Early 1-0 lead. Oh, oh there's, there's a, foul. a foul, but it's coming off. Referee's playing a little Kieran bit of advantage Bywater there. Kieran taken down. I'm not sure if the referee made the Luke, right one Luke there. Luke Parker took him yeah. down pretty hard. I think he's there's, getting frustrated. Yeah, blow the whistle there. There's no, there's a lot of red shirts in the way, and, and you want to give the players mm -hmm. the benefit of the doubt, but right. he got hit pretty right. hard there. Right, Kieran's on the ground there. Blow I think the whistle, he, he did get hurt there, but he's, uh, referee's letting play go on. Yeah. is trying to come through again. Snoopy's doing some work. Got Defense back his position broken there. down. He recognized that it comes in Chattanooga's way and they kick the ball no, out. Straight out of bounds. To allow Kieran to get some treatment from behind. Yeah, yep. And uh, yeah, it's just frustration at this point yep. for Memphis. Yep. Um, They've been chasing for long periods of this mm, game. Just not getting the game they the game the girl they want, want to go. Yep. So. Tonight's official attendance, 
not too bad, Simon. They Excellent. just announced the, uh, the official attendance over the loudspeakers here at Finley Stadium. Right. And uh, 3,464 people on a, on a beautiful Saturday night in Excellent. Chattanooga. It's, That's great. It's not too bad. Not too bad at all. It's a good crowd. It's been yeah. they all came out tonight. And, yeah, uh, they've, uh, they've been active. They have. They've uh, been noisy all night long. Yeah. So that's great. Uh, is, hoping the game gets finished before the rain gets here. There is yeah. some rain on the way in the area, but uh, so far it's dry. We've got a few minutes left to play. Oh, what a great ball nice in there. Ball. So we're hoping to finish in the dry tonight. CFC still pressuring the last couple of minutes as they started. Yeah. Pressure from the start, Ooh. pressure at the end. Couldn't quite connect there. And that breaks the game there. Memphis, Memphis is trying to come forward. But uh, that ball uh, again, Greg is there just it is. Let that one roll into the box. Greg is going to pick it up Take in the box. Yeah. yeah. That was That's it just again. Experience there from it Greg is. Hartley. Lots of experience, good timing. And uh, Chattanooga bringing the ball forward, driving on the last two or three minutes of the game. I'd like to see us keep a little bit more possession if we could. I don't, mm -hmm. I don't want them just driving those long balls and letting Memphis just have these waves. possession or waves of pressure. Right. Right. Um, you know, we want to defend and be That's smart. A good but, long throw, yeah, but it's so long. It's yeah, answer. It goes out for a goal. Right right that wraps up. Let's see if Chanu can get the third goal or uh, what happens next. Hopefully, it'll be another goal for them. <laughs> Snoopy fighting the ball, We're making oh, space. That's a good nice there. ball. Play through. Now, Aldred playing across. Yeah, and you saw him make that run forward to steal that ball. He yeah. made his pass and then he just turned around and kind of walked back into the space. Yeah. Just being smart. It's that right. time of the game. Right. I think we're going to have another substitution here make for Chattanooga States. Football oh, yeah. Club. Yeah. And uh, that's going to be Alejandro Pastor. And that, yes. this is going to be the first time we've seen him on the field this season. I think he's going to get some, some so, playing uh, time. I think the hooligans are going to be pretty excited to welcome him to, to Chattanooga Absolutely. Football Club in 2016. So Memphis trying to get the game going. It's come Dropped out to Sammy Goney. He's playing it to Zeka. Zeka's uh, in that's tons a good turn of space. By Zeka. Yeah. Yeah, I think we're just going to mosey on. Oh, well, hey. No. hey, he took a shot. Kicker of Stobbage Lake makes substitution. Yeah, I thought he was going to take it to the corner there and maybe waste the time, but hey, his friend wants to play and that's we're going right. to get him on the field. Even for a that's minute. Number, exactly <laughs> right. So Alejandro's coming on. Yep. Snoopy's going to be the one taking a break. He's worked very hard, had a good game. Yep. And, uh, he gets a nice round of applause from the crowd. It's a, it's a great welcome for uh, Mr. Pastor here in, in 2016, his debut mm -hmm. for the team um, this summer, and, and we're excited to see what he can bring to the game. And, right. and in the you know in the coming weeks, you know it's been a testament really this evening to the to the squad depth, and, and this is just another example of it bringing somebody new onto the field that that can add you know a lot. You know, okay. to our squad and, and right. just getting him some flow and some rhythm. You know, That's right. Even these short couple minutes it really helps. help a player with it his does. confidence. So we've been announced there'll be two minutes of extra time to be played tonight um, to make up for the, uh, the injuries and delays and so forth. Um, so regulation time is now stopped. There'll be two minutes kept on the field by the referee, so he will call the time. So don't watch the clock, watch the referee. Ooh. Try to flip the ball through, and he's gone. Still... Sammy Goney trying to come through. That's Carl Reynolds back to Sammy. Sammy's looking up, trying to find that space. Zeka with the ball, flicking it through to Sammy. Oh, yeah. Trying to steal it off the keeper, and Sammy goes down, but yep. nobody's hurt. Memphis trying to get the ball forward, but it just breaks down. It has Correct. been all New Orleans since then. Wow. Four to one now, and, and that's that's crazy. <laughs> but hey, man, this game's a lot of fun, especially when yes. the goals are flying in. Oh yes. Seen lots of them, lots of them throughout the southeast tonight. As long as it's for your team, yeah. it's fun. <laughs> exactly right. Chattanooga Football Club winding down extra time here. I have a sneaking suspicion this one's going to go all the way into the corner. I think so too. Uh, CFC is leading two to one, so you expect it. Two. And. Uh, Oh, they give away a, a throw-in throw from Memphis but City down deep there. Deep in the Memphis yep. half. And that's why they do it. Take it as far away from the goal as possible. Right. And even if they give away a throw-in or a corner kick or a goal kick, it's it means, it's not a scoring opportunity. No, it means the uh, pitch team's got to run all the way back down the field. And when you've got tired legs, it's a long run. Yeah, it's true. You really don't want to run more than you have to. Chanel getting possession back. Uh-oh. We the may have an opportunity nice here. Ball. Numbers forward. 
Number forward. Uh -oh. Here we go. Here comes Zeka. Here's the third one, Zeka. I think. Oh! oh. oh. Across the goal. Yeah, he tried to chip it over the oh. goalkeeper there. He got it past the right goalkeeper. Over. Just cross right the face of the post. goal. Yep. Unbelievable. That should have gone in. I can't believe that. Memphis definitely getting the ball back in the play as fast as they can. They know that clock's running down. Trying to come forward in numbers, but that's a great header. Not a problem. And, and there's that whistle. whistle. That's it, folks. Yep. That's it. 2 1 to Chattanooga FC over Memphis. Good game overall. Very good. Chattanooga started out yeah. really, really yeah. high pressure. Mm -hmm. Scored that early goal off of a corner kick. Memphis City was able to get another opportunity off of a corner kick of their own and right. score the equalizing goal. But then a great ball out of midfield mm -hmm. through to uh, Mr. Will Roberts at the top right. left of that box. Cut in with his right foot and just smashed it home for the game winner late into that first half. Right. And then uh, Really, the CFC defense in midfield was able to keep Memphis City at bay, and, and that's how the game ended. Two that was one. it. Yeah. It, was, it was an exciting game. It was. it was, Carlos. Same score at half time, went through the whole game. I've expected some more goals, yep. to be honest. Yep. Um, there were some scoring chances, it didn't come to anything. Were. And uh, it was a very good game. I'm, I'm glad the results of Chattanooga's way. It was, it was successful and uh, showed that they had the depth of the squad because. Coach Bill Elliott didn't get to play with the players he wanted to play because yep. for whatever reason they aren't around, and yet the, the squad still played great. So, exactly right. very successful night, another good result in the bag. Uh, kicks Chattanooga FC at the top of the table, I do believe, in the MPSL table for the Southeast. Yeah, not only um, the Southeast, but also the Volunteer Shield. Volunteer Shields, yep. more points, three yeah. points to the Volunteer Shield. So, uh, that's always good too. So, all around a good evening, everybody enjoyed it. And uh, a crowd of you know, 3,400. Nearly 3,500 people saw the game. Great on a Saturday night, so uh, very successful. We had a great evening, and thank you for being with us tonight and enjoying the game and watching along. We'd be glad you were. Thank you. Um